Hello and welcome to Paul Sherry Conversion Vans. We have over 50 conversion vans in stock, ready for immediate delivery. If you're on YouTube, hit that subscribe button so you can be assured to see all of our new arrivals, just like this one here today, as soon as they hit the lot. Also, if you want to see all the still pictures of this specific conversion van or any other conversion van that we currently have in stock, please visit our website at sherryvans.com. That's S-H-E-R-R-Y-V-A-N-S.com. Today we're showing you a brand new arrival, a 2012 uh, Chevrolet Explorer Limited SE all-wheel drive seven passenger conversion van, guys. Once again, it's an all-wheel drive. That is extremely hard to find these days considering they stopped making the all-wheel drive in the GM and Chevrolet chassis in 2014. Especially ones with low miles like this one here today with just over 30,000 miles. Like I said, guys, this is a uh, Explorer Limited SE, which is their top of the line. Um, it's going to have a bunch of bells and whistles on it, which we'll show you when we walk through here. Also, this is a high top conversion van, so it's going to give you an interior height of just over five and a half feet, which is an awesome feature, which we'll show you when we, we get inside also. Starting on the front of the vehicle with that Limited SE uh, from Explorer, which is their top of the line, you're going to get the upgraded front bumper. And as you can see, this front bumper is a two-tone, so it is silver in color, and the, and the chassis is actually a dark blue. Fog lights located on the bottom, those are LED fog lights, with the center license plate bracket located right here with the fold-down step. That fold-down step is extremely nice when cleaning that windshield um, right above you, as you can see there. Another thing with that limited SC is you're gonna get, you're gonna get the medallion ground effects that run along both sides of the conversion van, and they're really nice because they do hide the uh, the running board, which is located right inside the door, as you can see there. And that running board runs all the way along the side, so you can get in. You can use that running board for getting in the rear of the van as long as the front. Also on the rear, you're going to have the upgraded rear bumper, which comes with that limited SE. And as you can see there, it does have the uh, built-in backup sensors and also your trailer tow hitch right there, along with a seven-pin wiring hookup. With it being a seven passenger conversion van, it is extremely nice because you can enter this van in the back of it from both sides. So I'm on the passenger side right now, but you can also enter from the into the rear of the van from the driver's side too. With a seven passenger conversion van, you do get one row of captain's chairs, and then you're also going to get a rear power folding bench back there that can seat up to three people. Starting at the top of the rear of this conversion van, you're going to notice it does have an upgraded uh, sunroof. That is a power sunroof located right there above the rear bench seat, which does come with that limited SE package. And also you're going to notice along the sides up top where you're going to have uh, storage compartments located right here, and then also right here, and then on the other two sides also. Those are great for storing knickknacks, uh, maybe little pillows or blankets, whatever it may be. Also up on the ceiling, we do have uh, surround sound assist speakers throughout uh, on different spots located on the ceiling, and also your rear east AC and heat vents located up on the ceiling also. In the very rear center compartment, there is a Sony Blu-ray DVD player located right here, and that'll operate the rear TV, which I'll show you here in a minute. Plenty of charging ports throughout, located on the side of the bench. You're gonna have USB charging ports, plenty of cup holders, as you can see on both sides. Also on this side, you're also gonna have the porch where you could hook up a game system directly into this and you could um, play your game system directly on the rear TV. Also on the ceiling in the center, we have the uh, infinity lighting, as you can see there, which is a nice centerpiece uh, located right there in the center of the high top conversion van. You also have capability and the option of operating your rear AC and heat system from the rear of the van, which is located right here. And you can also op operate it from the front of the van. So if you wanna have full control while driving, you can do that also. As you can see, it does have a very large Vizio flat screen TV located right above the driver and passenger front seats, uh, which makes it an awesome feature while driving down the road. Uh, keep the kids or whoever it may be in the back quiet uh, while you're driving. Overall, I'd say this conversion van is in very good condition. I don't notice any stains, rips, tears on any of the seats. Everything overall looks really good. There is one mark on the door panel right there um, 
that could be fixed, should be fixed, and we'll probably get that fixed. I just noticed that. To the front of the conversion van, the front two seats are going to be both heated seats. They do have power lumbar, which is a really nice feature. Starting on the driver's steering wheel, on the left-hand side, you're going to notice we do have all the controls for your cruise control located right here. And then on the right-hand side, you have all the controls to operate your radio, and you can also adjust your volume on the back-hand side of the steering wheel here. This center button right here is a great feature. You could uh, you can pair your phone directly to this radio system, so you can simply hit this button here and answer your phone call while driving down the road, which is another really nice feature um, and definitely a great safety feature while driving down the road. A nice upgraded Pioneer radio system located here in the center. It's all fully touchscreen. And you do have your front AC and heat system located right here. And then, like I said, you can operate your rear heat, AC and heat system from up front right here. All your power for your all your rear lighting, for your, uh, your ceiling lighting, your infinity lighting, which I just showed you, your individual reading lighting that's in the back, and then your power sunroof buttons located right here also. Like I said, guys, this is a 2012 seven passenger Chevrolet Explorer conversion. It's a limited SE package, all wheel drive, which is extremely hard to find, especially in really good condition with low miles like this one here today. Guys, we are one of the largest conversion van dealers in the country with stocking over 50 new and pre-owned conversion vans from seven passengers to nine passengers, even mobility conversion vans. And guys, most importantly, we ship nationwide. So if you're looking for a conversion van and you live in California, we can deliver this vehicle directly to your house. And guys, this vehicle is located at Paul Sherry Conversion Van. Our website is sherryvans.com. If you'd like to see all the still pictures of the specific van or a full description of it, please visit our website. It's S-H-E-R-R-Y-V-A-N-S.com. There you're going to find a bunch of different conversion vans ranging from seven passengers to nine passengers even mobility vans and guys most importantly keep in mind we do ship nationwide and for the guaranteed best price on any newer pre-owned conversion van make sure you always shop paul sherry conversion vans